train the obliques. Essentially what I'm trying to do is stabilize this upper body position, prevent the rotation that wants to happen with this offloaded, one-sided loading of the rope. And it could be a bar, it could be a rope, it could be anything, but the fact is it's pulling my torso to, in this case, my right. I have to drive my arm out and then lock it there. And when it locked out in front of me, there's still that offset load that's pulling me back in that direction that I have to control. As you can see here, the speed and the pacing of every single rep is slow. That is what we want to go after here. Quality repetitions done slowly are going to provide you with the best opportunity to develop them. Now, let's say you're at a little bit higher level. You can become a bit more functional and do this more dynamic variation of the exercise in standing. And here I'm just simply striding out and striding back, making sure that I keep that bar orientated forward. If there's a line in front of my feet, I want that bar to match up with my feet. So I drive back and I drive out and I make sure once again in this more dynamic environment that I'm not allowing my obliques to break down and give in, but control that rotation and even prevent it. So this one exercise is one that I absolutely love because if you can dive